What's going on YouTube? This is SG1 Sports and you're watching our Big Ten Football Channel. ESPN recently updated their FPI rankings for the upcoming 2020 college football season and we're going to break down Indiana's ranking. Indiana is a team that surprised a lot of people last year. I don't think many people expected them to have the type season that they had. Almost uh, won their, should have probably won their bowl game against Tennessee and it would have been you know, one of the better years we've seen from Indiana in a long, long time. Can they do it again? What does the FBI think? Well, we're going to show you. Well, they've got them as a top 25 team, number 23 in the country. Their FBI is 11.5. That means on a neutral field against an average opponent, Indiana would win by 11.5 points. So that's pretty solid. Again, you look at what Indiana normally does uh, to be considered a top 25 team preseason those are pretty high expectations uh, for this Indiana team. So let's get into their projections. Uh, we'll start with their a record projection. The FBI has them going about 7.4 and 4.3. So 8 and 4, maybe 7 and 5, somewhere in there, uh, which is, again, a very solid year for Indiana if they're able to do that, especially when you've got Ohio State, Penn State, and Michigan in your division. Uh, if you can get to seven or eight wins, I think that's a pretty solid year, and the FBI expects them to be able to do that. Uh, let's now see what they what the odds are of them going undefeated. That would be winning every regular season game and winning the conference championship, 0%. So they have no chance of going undefeated this year. I would agree with that. I mean, again, like I just said, you've got to play Ohio State and Penn State and Michigan, uh, and we'll show you the rest of the schedule in just a second. I believe they open up the year with Wisconsin. Uh, so it's a pretty tough schedule. Again, we'll also show you what the FBI thinks about each individual game on that schedule. Uh, but they do have a really good shot of getting to a bowl game. A 96.2% chance of making it to a bowl game, getting to six wins. That is a really high number. Really high number, especially when you, you look back at kind of the history of Indiana and what they normally do. You know, this is a team that usually struggles to make a bowl game. But they think that last year... Uh, was was not a fluke. They're going to build on that success and make a bowl game again this year. And there are some teams that are going to be pretty bad in the Big Ten this year. I think that helps. Uh, they have a 0.9% chance of winning the Big Ten East. I would be okay if you put that at 0% because, again, the division is so tough. Uh, to expect a team like Indiana to go in there and win that division, uh, it's, it's not going to happen. I think 0.9 is pretty generous, honestly. I would probably have that at 0% or maybe 0.1%. Uh, but the FBI gives them a shot. It's not much of a shot. They also give them a 0.2% chance of winning the whole thing, winning the Big Ten. Now, that would mean winning the division and the conference championship game, which is something that I just I don't see Indiana doing. They've even got a 0.1% chance of making the college football playoff. Making the college football playoff, yes. Indiana with a 0.1% chance of doing that. They do have a 0% chance, though, of making it to the national championship. And then you go a step further. Obviously, if they have no chance of making the national championship, they have no chance of winning the national championship. So those numbers are zero. But all in all, I'd say the FBI really likes this Indiana team compared to what others might think of them. Let's look at the schedule. And as you can see, they only have four games where they're going to be underdogs. They're pretty big underdogs in those games. Wisconsin just 13%. Penn State, well, 25% against Penn State. That's not a bad number. Not a bad number at all. Seven against Ohio State. Uh, and how about that? On the road at Michigan, 37.6% chance. So, yes, the FBI give them a sh giving them a shot against Michigan and, and a decent chance against Penn State. That is pretty surprising. Uh, they're pretty big favorites against Purdue and Illinois. Michigan State's at 85%. I don't understand why Rutgers is not higher, um, but I guess because on the road maybe 79.6% uh, there. Maryland's 89%. UConn, 95%. Ball State, 94%. Western Kentucky, 88%. So they're going to be pretty heavy favorites in every single game, you know, outside of the, the four games where they're underdogs. Uh, they will be at least a 76% favorite in the rest of these games. So you can see how if they win those games, they could get to eight and four this year, pull off an upsetting against Michigan or maybe even Penn State. And all of a sudden, you could talk, be talking about Indiana going nine and three this year. FBI really high on this team. Are you high on Indiana? Let me know down in the comments be below what you think about Indiana, uh, what you think about their FBI ranking, uh, and we'll see what happens. But thanks for watching this video, and stay tuned for more here on the SG1 Sports YouTube channel.